All right, welcome back, everybody, and here we go. Let's find our way home. There's the real queen. Let's have a chat with her. You're the real queen, Lean, huh? You really could be my twin. Well, you go to you, know, you two go better. Oh, shit, I can't read. I'll keep my fingers crossed. Blah blah blah. Excuse me. Oh, never mind. I guess it's time to go. Oh, I get it. I get it, because the... Oh, okay. Moving along. Now. <sighs> I guess you would just go back to where you were, you know, where you came into this world. Let's take a look at old Marl. She's going to come up to where... I mean, uh... Yeah, she's going to come up to the level to where we're at. Or at least around it. You know, like, if I was two, she would be two when we got here. But, uh... Yeah, I'm glad she's at, you know, whatever she's at now. She's, you know, really good. Marl's actually a really good character to keep in your party. I prefer other characters later on. In fact, I, 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 I never use Marl or Luca once you, you know, get access to other people. That's all I'm going to say. Oh, birds! But, uh... I don't know, I just never really liked them. Best way to put it, they're just too weak for me. I like to do a whole lot of damage, you know, as quick as possible. You know, it's weird because, you know, later on there's uh, two different characters. One character's a, a must in my party at all times, you know, aside from Chrono. And then the other guy that's going to go in here is really just a toss up between two other characters. I guess we'll get to that problem, that uh, bridge, when we get there. We'll cross that bridge when we get to it. You know. uh, let's just avoid all this. You don't want to fight it. Keep moving, keep moving. Oh, too bad. Gotta fight a, some sort of creature. Poli? Or poly? I guess he called a poly, like really poly. Throw a rock at me. Okay, come on. What is this? Everything's faster than me? Dead. God, you suck, Luca. Finally. Ah, <sighs> living experience point is not bad, really. It's a, there's a spot the, towards the you know, when you get to the side quest portion of the game, that's really, really good for leveling up. And I'm probably going to go there a lot, but here we are. How do we get home? Your Highness, or Princess, we... Please, call me Marl. Well then, Marl, observe. Da -da -da. Wow. Luca, you're amazing. And she's terrible. Ain't it the truth? Wow, she's stuck, stuck up, too. Oh, I'm, I mean... Enough with the false modesty. You have a real gift. I would trade my royal ancestry for you, genius, in a heartbeat. Well, if you say so. Anyway, I call this thing a gate. It's a kind of portal that takes you to the same location in a different era. Gates are very unstable, so I use the principle behind my telepod device. To create a gate key. Now we can use them as we please. But why did this gate suddenly appear? Either the telepod had something to do with it, or something else made it. This is getting pretty weird. Let's at least get hit back to our own time. It's a good idea. Alright, coming, Chrono. And here we go. Whee! And we encounter something that looks like a bad LSD trip again. And we're back. Hooray! Phew, we're back. Chrono, Luca, why don't you come home with me to the castle? I'd like you to come over for dinner. Sorry for putting you through all that, Marl. Are you joking? That's the most fun I've had in months, and I have some new friends, too. Chrono, be a gentleman and take her home. I've got some work to do. Oh, you figures. Don't want to take ten minutes to take her home with me. Will you escort me home, Chrono? No. 
I'm pretty sure I missed something earlier. Really. See the cathedral, the cathedral's gone now. No more cathedral. I mean, it was never there, but that's the reason it's not there. In the present. We can avoid all of this crap because we just don't care. Like a boss. There we go. And to the castle we go. Princess Nadia, are you all right? Where have you been? I heard you were abducted. We had soldiers searching for you. Scoundrel, you're the one, huh? Kidnapping Princess Nadia. No, Kronos. Admit it, you confused her and tried to take over the throne. Terrorist! <laughs> Stop it. He works for the Bush administration. <laughs> Stop this at once. And they all kneel. Kneel before Zod. What are you doing? But Princess Nadia said to... Idiots detain him! God, they tackled me. Uh, earlier, uh, back in time, the Chancellor mentioned something about starting a judicial system to weed out all the evil fiends. I'm now a victim of this, you know, judicial system that he's set up. And I'm the Chancellor, the Prosecutor. I'm the lawyer, Pierre. Wow, it's Pierre's his name. Members of the court, we now bring forth the defendant, Chrono, who is charged with abducting Princess Nadia. Hooray! Cheer! Yay. What shall we do with him? Fire, perhaps? Hang him upside down for a few years, or shall we employ the guillotine? Yes, they are. You, the jury, shall decide his fate. Now let us begin. Is it a guillotine or a guillotine? Guillotine. Guillotine. Chrono, you are hereby ordered to tell the truth. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah. Chrono is charged with premeditated abduction of royalty. The question is, did he kidnap Princess Nadia? The answer, no, he did not. In fact, no abduction, uh, no abduction took place. The two met completely by accident. In fact, the princess asked Chrono if she could join him. That's how I remember it. Is this true? Who actually started this whole mess? Marl did. Are you sure? We have witnesses who say that you were the one that bumped into the princess. Hey. Ouch, that hurt. Actually, I think I should have said that I did it. That what makes me look better, but... The princess then innocently followed you to Luca's little sideshow, whereupon you both disappeared. If that wasn't criminal abduction, I don't know what is. Yeah, but I took her back. Doesn't that account for anything? And I have facts that throw the defendant's character into question. Objection. This can't have any relevance whatsoever to this case. Care to respond, Chancellor? Krona's character is the very core of this case. We have nothing to hide. We have a witness, a little girl, who will vouch for the character of the defendant. Girl. This nice man, he brought me my kitty. Thank you for being so kind. Oh, wow, thank you. How about that? Doesn't this young man deserve a medal? I agree. Shoot, looks like you're buying it. <laughs> like he throws that in there. The issue here is motive. Was there any motive for the fine citizen to kidnap Princess Nadia? No, there was none. What about ransom? Chrono, her fortune did tempt you, did it not? No. Are you sure? You weren't? You really weren't tempted? No, no. That's enough. I have no more questions. It is evident that my client is a fine, noble young man, Your Honor. The defense rests. Members of the jury, if he is guilty, stand to the left. If innocent, stand to the right. Not guilty. Yay! 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 I don't know. I can't remember. It's only seven, six. Yay! 
<laughs> Yay! But this isn't a normal jury. Yay! <laughs> That's right, bitches. And... Oh, you asshole! Order in the court. A verdict has been reached. The verdict is not guilty. But the fact remains that even if he did not kidnap her, he ran off with her. Three days solitary confinement is punishment. Take him away! Now, just a darn minute. Princess! That's enough, my dear. But father... All I asked was for you to behave like a princess. Even royalty must obey rules. Leave the rest up to the Chancellor and forget about the events in town. We're leaving. Chrono! Oh. 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 So terrible. <sighs> this terrorist has tried to overthrow our kingdom. He has been found guilty and must now carry out his sentence. Wait a minute. Are you worried? So this is the monster who kidnapped the princess. The execution is <laughs> three days away. What? Do not let him out. Yes. Wait, execution? Yeah, exact execution. Strange, but I don't seem to recall hearing anything about an execution. What? How dare you question me? The paperwork's probably just been held up in the system. Understood, sir. Guards! Guard. Take the prisoner away. No, it wasn't. Oh, and then he hit me with a sword. I should be dead. That should be the execution. He just struck me over the head with a frickin' sword. What? That's a sword. Alright, we okay, we got the save point right here, which we're gonna use. We've got a care package. Some sympathizers brought that stuff for you, you lousy fella. What we got here? Got one ether. That was it. Okay, now. Alright. Alright, now there's several ways to just two ways to do this actually. So there's two days until the execution. I could wait out the two days and something happens. Or I could do this. Pipe down. Pipe down. Knock it off. Oh, I'll show him. Open it up. Oh, run to the back of the cell. Ooh, God, he hit me so hard with his sword. Again, something that should have killed me. That's what you get for misbehaving. Oh, you bastard, I'll show you. Uh, got to take my bucket sword away, bitch. Ah! Oh. Yes, that's right. They threw him in jail and didn't take all his weapons away. Where do you think you're going? Kill you, bitches. You hear me? Everything must be killed. Clomp. Okay. Now, there's a few little things here to explore. Let's see, we can go down here and. What are you up to? Let me get my fighting stance here. <laughs> It's a decent experience points. I mean, it's pretty terrible for one person because I believe with you know less, you get, it's like Final Fantasy. You get more people, more experience with less people. I think. And we've got a mid tonic, a mid tonic, an ether, and an ether. We're gonna continue on our little. Uh oh. So you the escaped con? Oh no. <laughs> God damn it. Omnichrome is his name. 
you know, he, he missed me because he's got like a one eye. So his depth perception is not all that fantastic. <laughs> he missed me again. I mean, it's just further proving my point, you know. But, oh yeah, you're dead. They don't pay me enough for this. <laughs> he runs away. Come back here, you bastard. Do, 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 do. Now, it's possible to just run in between them like that, so you don't have to fuck with them. Because they are a pain in the ass. Alright, let's go in here. Oh, it's a little, it's a little flame! It's a little flame, run! And... Oh, it's a skeleton! No, it's a descendant. That, I don't know what that exactly means, but it's one. And it's, and it's good. Okay. Oh, you son of a bitch. The prisoner is escaping! Oh no, the prisoner is escaping. That's me. I'm escaping. And he's gone. Oh, he hit me. 10 damage, too. I mean, that's, that's, that's a good little amount. 10 damage. Dun -dun -dun -dun. Okay, now there's two ways to do this. See, now I never understood that. I don't know how to freak to get past him. Either way, yeah, he's about to die, so it doesn't matter to me. And he's gone. Hooray! Oh, that's what you can do. Hey, fella. Help me! Save him? Absolutely. Hey, you're a lifesaver. I'm Fritz. My dad wants to store in Truth's Village. Stop by if you're in the area. Okie dokie. Doo 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 doo. Got a bronze mail. And a descendant. Dun dun dun. Now, if you kill something that's already dead, what do you do it? What, 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 are, you, are you killing it again? Ow. Uh, 24, okay. What are you up to? And he's gone. Okay, guys, before we head upstairs, we're going to go ahead and stop it here. And when I come back, we're going to make our way out of this dungeon of all kinds of evilness and stuff. So uh, stay tuned, fellas and gals. People stay tuned. Thank you. Yeah.